Nelson Kuhlman will draw in. No changes for Barry Trotz and the New York Islanders. Fourth line against fourth line again. Sit back and enjoy game number two from Boston off the faceoff. Point Sasekas. It goes off Letty. He's hounded by Kuhlman. And it comes back out. 14th playoff game for Carson Kuhlman. First this season. Charlie Coyle out in front. He's does it again in the neutral zone turnover and then here comes Coyle and what a strong move he throws the puck to the middle and goes and gets it here it is again backhand puts the puck in an area goes and gets it uses his strength and on the first shot of the game for the Bruins they take a one nothing lead you see what happened there Lenny got caught playing on the right sank a little bit so we'll keep an eye on Barlamov after allowing that one Games two and three on round one against Pittsburgh. A chance for Lamont sets no. Brad Marchand had the opportunity. Green out the center by Beauvillier. Good shifts of the game, very strong, and then the penalty. And that changed everything. Everly, great stop by Rats. Until now. Carlo. He'll take it back to the point. Little deferral for Krejci. His shot stopped by Lamont. What a save on the rebound. off by Pellick. He'll send it in. Carlo looks over both shoulders. Sezikas all over him. Clutterbuck says hello to Bergeron. A rap chance. Rats a couple of times on Sezikas. Who moves it back for Adam Pellick. Reset it. Through the middle. Right on the money. On a change. Krejci. And now Pasternak. A drag doesn't work on Pellick. Across it goes. A shot. Pellick off a dandy on McAvoy. What a block by Ryan Pollock. And the play is blown dead prior to that. Clifton, it's moved around by Nelson for Paul Merritt. He'll send it back to the point. Josh Bailey. Down the boards on Wagner. Now he creeps in slowly across it. Goes it to flex. Home! It pinballs by Tuka Rask. Initiated by Josh Bailey. It's a power play goal. And the Islanders have tight. Here it is again. Let's see if it's Lazar, number 20. Bailey to the left. No, it's actually Lausanne that hits Lausanne and then deflects in. And so the power play goal right there off the skate of Lausanne through the legs of Rask. And the Islanders use their power play to tie this game at a goal apiece. Josh Bailey, the hero of game number five in the Pittsburgh series, a double overtime game winning goal in that one. Now are very comfortable in the way they're playing. In the Ryan Pollock. Out in front, Rask says no, Leo Komarov. What a smart pinch by Ryan Pollock to set that whole play up, Johnny and Joe. Stretches out the ice for Pajot. He'll go wide, he'll stop. Button hook, lay it back. Letty with a shot through a screen wide. And they poke it home again. Kyle Palmieri jamming at the side of the goal. Rask had no idea where it was. And the Islanders have a 2-1 to one lead. Up on the play. Here's the long pass. Now they slow it down. Good job here by Pajot. Nick Letty then follows it up. Misses the net. But right there in front is Kyle Palmieri to bang it in. Palmieri in front of the net. One whack at it. Has maybe one more. And that might have gone in off of Carlo, actually. But good work in front of the net. Kyle Palmieri will get credit for it. And the Islanders with two quick goals now lead it 2-1. You know, Joe, we talked about the defense accelerating the pace of the game, coming out clean. It's off the stick of Corrali, around the clock. Barzell now will stretch it out. Side of the goal, Bovillier out in front. They score! Jean-Gabriel Pajot on a beautiful play. It's a power play goal, and the Islanders are up by two. And Bovillia right there, 18, watch, he'll get it, and then just throw it over to the other side. And they're late coming back to Pajot, who puts it in the empty side. Barzell, quick pass, same with Bovillia, and the finish by Pajot to give the Islanders a two-goal lead. Barzell and Bovillia will get the assists on the Pajot power play goal. And Barzell, a self-pass, he'll get after it. Butterbuck's out in front, he'll turn it back. 
All the way across, what a chance, a stop by Raz off the stick of Matt Martin. Marzell again, Joe, what a nifty cross ice pass to Matt Martin, to Karaz. He'll poke it along for Marchand, he'll move it all the way back here, and it's held in by Pasternak. To the outside, Marchand turns around. Just about perfect support on the puck, moving the puck around, get back in an, in an area where you can get it back, and then the passing and the shot. It might have just deflected off of Dobson and Patrice Bergeron with the shot, and the Bruins within one. That's just a hockey sense goal. Bergeron backs away from the traffic, creates that opening for Marchand to move the puck. One entry, Marchand. They'll drop it back for McAvoy. Charlie McAvoy popping out as Marchand a shot. He scores! has tied it! And does a good job of coming right back into the zone with puck control. Marchand carried it, now puts himself back in position to get it, and then there's the shot just inside the far post. He tries to use Mayfield, the defenseman, as a screen, head up, quick release, tie game. And Joe, the reason why Mayfield can't come up, Pasternak's on the icing line. Mayfield's worried that if he comes in attack. Down three to one. Bergeron and Marchand bring the Bruins back. They force overtime in game two. And to Casey Sezikas on the draw. Overtime underway here in Boston. Scott Mayfield paired on defense with Nick Letty for the Islanders. You see it come all the way back to the Boston zone. The Islanders await all of that. Taylor Hall steps in. Up high, McAvoy, a handoff for Krejci, a shot. Kicked out the rebound. Oh, He will step in the zone, out in front, stopped by Varlamov. Carson Kuhlman looking for that one. Lausanne blocks, it's a breakaway. KC Sezikis with a game on a stick. He scores! KC Sezikis wins it in overtime, and the Islanders have tied the series. On right here, 55 has it. Hits a zone man skate, and here comes Sezikis and the finish. A high rising shot over the right shoulder of Tuka Rask. And the Islanders withstand the Boston comeback in the third period and find a way to tie this game on the unassisted goal by Casey Zizekas. A celebration for the Islanders.